uh, I'm an animal care intern here, subbing in for Jeanette, our animal care supervisor. I will be feeding our lizards today. So we have four lizards, but we have two of each. We have our western side blotch lizards and then our southern alligator lizards. We're going to be feeding them some crickets, some really tiny crickets. And we cover them in calcium powder, so that's why they look white. It's to make sure that they get all the nutrients they need when they're not outside. So we'll start with our southern alligator lizards. We'll see if we can wake them up. They like to sleep in the day. There's one already right there. <laughs> I think they're hungry and waiting. So all of our lizards and amphibians eat crickets here. Oop. So the alligator lizards are probably our second most common lizards on the trails. Sometimes you'll see them, but they're pretty big if you can get them to come out of this thing. Most of the lizards on the trails have a very distinctive and common color scheme, which is the brown and blacks, because it just blends in very well with their environment. And we have them by the sun here because they need to bask in the sun to make sure they're warm because they're cold-blooded lizards. And you can see how long the alligator lizard just now was. We have two of them. I'm wondering if the other one. No. You see the other? They like to hide in the woods sometimes, so we're pretty lucky that this one came out. I'll get some more crickets. Sometimes it's difficult to catch them eating, so hopefully we're lucky today. I don't think we'll catch her eating, so we'll move on to our western side blotch lizards, which are the most common on the trails. You'll see them scurrying around if you come and walk on the trails with us. So we have two, but when we first got the other one, they were kind of territorial. And so lizards will sometimes drop their tails if they feel threatened and want to escape. So our little guy over here, if you can't tell, you can see that, oh, <laughs> she's running away. You can see that her tail is actually missing and she's starting to grow a new stub. The western side blotch lizards are very short-lived. Their lifespan is about a year at most, but they're very common and they mate pretty much all year round, so. But like I said, they're very territorial, especially the males. I think you could get a good glimpse of the tail now that's missing. She was really hungry today. I think that's about it for our lizards because we couldn't catch the southern alligator lizard eating. So I'm sorry about that, but our center is open to the public now. We do ask that you stay six feet apart and that you have a mask. But if you're on the trails, you don't have to wear a mask unless you're passing by people. But thank you for tuning in today.